Hello everybody and thank you very much for watching. In this video, we'll show you how I set up the racing in VR using Samsung DeX, Shadow PC, and Oculus Quest. The, my setup is looks messy, but it's, it's quite simple once you understand everything, how it's connected. I'm, I'm using Galaxy Tab S6 to act as my Samsung DeX device. And the portable monitor, just to see what's happening on the DeX, obviously, just do a couple of changes, couple of settings. I'm using a Logitech G27 USB steering wheel to obviously control the car. And I'm using virtual here and a tail scale service, a tail scale programs combined to push USB, USB, -C, USB signal over AP to shadow PC. For picture streaming in VR, I'm gonna use a virtual desktop service, virtual desktop program setup. How to set up virtual desktop, I will leave a link in the description below for you to go and check it out on one of the videos I found on YouTube. It's very helpful, it's very easy to follow. I follow his video and I got everything set up in no time. So as you can see on the screen right now, I have virtual here, virtual here USB server running. Right now, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna plug in my USB G27 steering wheel and I'm getting messages on the screen popping up saying the wheel's been detected. Do you want virtual here to use this? I'm gonna say yes, yes, and yes. So wheel is done halfway calibration, that's fine. So that's running and I'm just quickly gonna check if we have a tail scale connected. So I'm gonna open tail scale and see tail, tail scale is connected and everything is running. So we're gonna start shadow PC now. So I'm inside the shadow PC now. So what I'm gonna do now, I'm just gonna find the virtual here. Where is it, where is it, where is it? Here's go, virtual here. I'm gonna open this up. I'll wait for virtual here to connect to my Samsung De Samsung Tab S6 virtual here server via tail scale. I'm just gonna double click on G27 wheel. And right now I should have the, the wheel connected. Yeah, the spring is working. And I'm just gonna go and find the Logitech app just to confirm that the steering wheel is definitely connected. So if I'm gonna press the buttons, yeah, everything is working. Uh, I'm getting the messages or oh, arrows, um, lines popping up is detecting the key presses. So that's done. Next, we need to open up this desktop streaming app, which I'm gonna use to um, stream the signal to the Oculus Quest headsets. Oculus Quest glasses. So how to set this up? Like I said, I'll leave a link in the description below for you to go and check it out. But that is running now. Next thing, I'm just gonna put the glasses on and I'll meet you inside. So I'm connected to Shadow PC via desk, de virtual desktop program. And as you can see, I can move around and I'm moving around the head and I'm looking in all the corners of the desktop. I'm gonna start the Steam on my Shadow PC. Let's wait for a second for Steam to load connecting to my account. And in about a second or so, I should be inside this team. Great, at the top right, I'm just gonna click on VR. And right now Steam VR is launching. And because I'm using a virtual desktop, which has been streamed to the Oculus Quest 2 headsets, I will be able to interact with the virtual, with the Steam VR. I'm just gonna quickly try to figure out where is my controller, because I'm gonna have to control inside there and jump around just to be able to select the game. There you go, I am inside the Steam VR. Now I'm just gonna click on the Project Cars 2. And hopefully everything's gonna work. This is our third time I'm trying this. First time was a bit of a hit and miss, not everything works straight away. But hopefully right now on the third run, I hope everything's gonna work fine. I'm just quickly gonna move the controllers out of the way. Right, okay. So we're starting the game. I need to find the mouse and we're gonna see how it's performing. So I'm just gonna do custom race. So we are, we're just gonna click start and I hope everything will be fine. Uh, first thing, um, what I would like to say is I'm very, very bad at the racing games and VR. This is like, like I said, third time I'm trying something like this. So I might be uh, a bad driver. So just please bear with me. So, let's try. The steering wheel has the force feedback. Everything is working as expected. Oh, no, 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 no. I can't believe it's actually working. Well, I tried this three, three times already, but I'm still baffled that this is all working. And this, this feels like I'm actually playing on on the racing PC. Oh, I lost it. Well, 
I'm able to catch them up. Oh, too much hand break. Too much braking. I lost so much speed. No one, so I can look through a rear view mirror to see if anyone behind me. Obviously, no one behind me because I'm probably the last one. So, I'm, like I said, I'm not the greatest driver, but still, uh, this is absolutely amazing how it's, how it's working, how I'm managing to get such a decent gaming experience using the oh, using the uh, so many connections happening back and forward to Shadow PC from my Samsung Dex. It's, it's unbelievable. No, 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 no. Come on. Let's drive a bit more because I'm enjoying so much. Okay, okay. Oh. The car is sliding. Sliding. As you can see, it's a bit frame jumping in the screen. Look, oh. Oh my goodness sake, believe me, I felt that, I felt that I'm definitely sliding. And as you can see, the wheel going nuts, because, yeah, the force feedback is working. That was enough for me. Okay, 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 relax, relax, steering wheel, relax. This is absolutely amazing. Everything what I used in this video to make this happen, I will leave the link in the description below for you to go and check it out. All the videos that I used to help me to get this, I will leave in the description for you to go and check it out. If you have any suggestion for me, what I should go and try next with the Oculus Quest. Some, I have a couple ideas, but I just want to know what you would like to me try. And um, <laughs> I'm still shaking, it's so amazing. Thank you much for watching. And I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.